Welcome back to Elite Force. Well, let's get that derelict space gun, shall we? Grab my helmet from my locker. Uh, go to the equipment room, get my weapons ready. All right. Oviedo, need something? All right. Better make it quick. That harvester ship doesn't look very friendly. I know, we learned that. Ooh, yeah. Gold phaser. All right, let's get my helmet. I sure hope Tuvok is right about this gunship being operational. I don't think I want to come face to face with those harvesters. Tuvok's usually right. We got plenty of time to board the ship and fire. After this, we should be free and clear. Yeah, but you know what they say. What? If you see a light at the end of the wormhole, it's probably a boat on torpedo. <laughs> Man, Joe, sometimes you make me think Murphy must have been a bullion. Who's Murphy? You know, Murphy's Law. Ah, trust me, you'd like him. Hmm. Alright. You're right, man. Monroe. Alright, I got my helmet. Are you alright, Austin? I'm fine. Alex, what do we know about these harvesters? Not much. We know they can tear a ship to pieces, and even the board are scared of them. Totally resistant to assimilation. Well, better that we get a move on and not find out. All right. Let's get moving. Time to go to the transport. Hey, wow. Okay, jeez. Hey, may I help you? Apparently not. I think uh, the entire team still isn't ready. Okay. Let's check the mess hall. Oh no, there's no one around. I uh, don't see a spaceship. You know what? I want to use my minigun. Oh, Gatling gun. It's not really a minigun. Alright, let's do this. I was like, what's wrong with him? Oh, he's... Coordinates received and lost okay. data, sir. Energized. I was really confused. I'm like, um, yes? Gravity's a little light here. Should have brought grav boots. Power to this area must be partially out. What are those? Looks like fighters. Fighters? I thought this ship didn't have a crew. Maybe they're automated. We do not have time for idle speculation. We should proceed. Interesting. trying. Oh wait, there's stuff down here. Maybe there's... Ooh, actually, you can get quite high. Not that high, though. Hmm. No, okay. Wait, what about... Oh! Really? Maybe? No. Okay. 
Um, thinking, thinking, thinking. <clears throat> Oh, 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 gravity. We oh. Really? Do not need that. Mr. Chell, if you would. You know, I'm gonna try and use this new gun as long as I have open ah. Come on. I guess we're waiting for everybody to walk on one at a time. Or are the rest gonna stay up here? No? Okay. Oh boy. Wait for it. You're the last one to come in. Okay. before I glitch into something. All right, let's see what we There's got. There's some serious damage here. Would have taken quite a while to see that much damage to this ship. We must get to the elevator at the end of this hall. Oh, I saw that. I saw that. The door's being jammed by something. There was a crew after all. A small crew, perhaps. So where are they? Harvesters. I'm sure we'll find out soon. The control room is still one deck above this one. We must get to that elevator. Mm. Chang, see if the debris can be blown clear. Chell, find a layout of this deck. Satlos, you and I will attempt to force the jammed door. Monroe, Murphy, see if there's an alternate route. Okay. I mean, I thought this was. I don't know, sir. I don't think this door can be opened without moving whatever's blocking it on the other side. Mr. Chang, what is your assessment? No good, sir. The molecular density and tensile strength of this material is so high, my dead packs would barely scratch the surface. Looks like there's a maintenance hatch on the other side. But. Interesting. Wait. I can't get much out of this turn. Haha. 
I'm a genius. Hey, Alex found a ventilation shaft. I now know what it hit me. This reminds me of a PlayStation 1 or 2 Aliens game. I can see him. Mr. Monroe, see what's jamming the door. Hello? Ah. If I could turn that. Nope. No. Might as well top it off a little. to turn you, but how? It's clearly a medical bed of some kind. Can say a while. safety reasons, I'm immediately moving you over here. I don't care if anything doesn't happen with that, but you do not want a gun pointing at your allies. You did it. Nice work, Monroe. Thank you. Sound deductive reasoning answer. Good work. I mean, it took me longer than I thought, but we got it. On, chill. That's all right. New area. Okay. All right. Back to waiting. Hope you all like this. Hey, at least I'm enjoying the game. Just this part right here is a little slow. A little ridiculous, but I get what they're doing. They're trying to be atmospheric and more realistic for the times. Mm. Have a little sip of coffee. I'm also expecting one of these times this happens, someone's gonna get grabbed or attacked. Because they keep that last person every time I think. 
I think something's gonna happen. All right, time to load the new area. I want in. Oh my. Oh, look at that. Now this is a control room. Oof. Chell, seal the door in case there are more scavengers. Hey, this room looks pretty much untouched. The harvesters must not have made it this far. The crew must have stopped them. But it cost them their lives. All set. Don't jinx it, please. Environmental integrity has been restored. You may now remove your helmets. I found something. Looks like an audio log. Can you play it back? Yeah. I'm processing it through the translator now. Help me! Help me! Ah! They're tearing through the hall! Our weapons are useless! I can't! The defense systems are cut off! We're going to be slaughtered! No, no, get back! No, no! Ah! Ah! Somebody help us, please! They're killing us all! Tearing our ship apart from their unstoppable back! Ah! Oh my god. Distractions are not going to aid us in achieving our objectives. <laughs> that must have been the harvesters. Mr. Chell, control yourself. They're gonna tear Voyager apart. That is precisely what we are here to prevent. However, there has been a setback. Oh no. Guess I spoke too soon. Yep. I can aim the gunship and fire it from here. But the loading mechanism seems to be malfunctioning. The charge will have to be loaded manually. Ensign Monroe, take a small team to the barrel here and ride the maintenance tram to the end. The plasma focusing router here is misaligned, cutting off power to the firing mechanism. You will have to adjust it. Then make your way down to the firing chamber. Once there, you have to load the energy round into the firing chamber. When you've loaded the charge, I will then be able to fire the gunship. All right, Chang, Satlos, you're with me. Chell, you and Telsia stay here. <gasps> I thought it was going to be me. Yeah. Hey, don't worry, the ship's deserted. Should be no problem. I have disabled all the security locks on lifts and doors in the rest of the vessel. You should have no difficulties proceeding from here. Should have no difficulties. Hmm. Also, that's one of the main reasons why, uh, clean not clean on geez. You, you want those guys because well, their emotions and all that. Way. You. Doesn't matter. As soon as we're done, we're beaming out of here. Watch it. Uh oh. What's this? Don't touch it. Don't touch anything. Uh oh. Mr. Monroe, what's happening down there? I'm reading a power surge. Oh. 
All right. Mr. Monroe, what's your status? This ship isn't quite as dead as we thought, sir. There were no indications of such a defense system here. They must be controlled from a different part of the ship. We'll just have to be careful. Agreed. Tuvok out. Maybe they're just maintenance bots. And we must be an infestation to them. I was enjoying that. That was actually pretty fun. And there's a control pen. Do I want to attempt it? No. I don't know if I'd be able to get back up if I went to that control pen. Nice shooting, Monroe. I think this gun will be more useful. Oh, Kratz, I ran out of energy. Let me see, can I skip this? What's I it? can oh, darn. Don't touch anything. Also, I love how I'm uh -oh. so tired right now. I almost called him a history Spock. Well, that's not it. And then Klingon. That's not it. It's Vulcan. Mr. Monroe, what's happening down there? I'm reading a power surge. This ship isn't quite as dead as we thought, sir. There were no indications of such a defense system here. They must be controlled from a different part of the ship. We'll just have to be careful. Maybe they're just maybe agreed. Not. Tuvok out. And we must be an infestation to them. <laughs> I'm about to die. Let's do it. No idea what that did. Alright, I got some ammo. I'm gonna go grenade launcher. Never mind. This weapon was literally made for this level. Hey, gents, do you have help? Because I need it. I'm a bit rusty. I'm not doing so well. Wait, what? Run, 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 run. Oof. Actually, no. I was gonna say, ooh, health. No, there's no health there. Everyone on. Oh, wait, what? Ow. That was a sucky reload. 
And let's go again. On um, both of you, come on, chip chip. Um, excuse me. Elevator glitched out. Hmm. <laughs> the elevator glitched out. That's a funny one. That hasn't happened yet. Let's try this again. I wonder how good this gun does against them. They're machines. Everyone on. Let's try this again. Deserve that. Oh, oop, oop. Went better, but whatever. I want to use this more if I keep killing my teammates. Full health. Is there anything in here? we go too far forward, I'm going to top off my health. 
I can at least do that. There. Huh? Ah. Alright, if you guys want to go forward, go ahead. Is that supposed to be flying sideways? Oh, it's on a spaceship, isn't it? That's not a spaceship, that's a mech. Boss fight? for the win. Woo! You want to use the sticky grenades? Looks they seem like to the do more damage. Move on is down this lift where the robot came from. All right, one second. Let me get this way. All right, let's go. Woo! Okay, that boss wasn't that bad. Guys, please stay behind me. God damn it. Welding tool, but it makes a decent weapon. I'll say. I mean, I'm gonna try it again. an excellent tutorial how that weapon works. <laughs> I like it. I want that. Oh, it sucks. <laughs> That's on me. I'm not leaving until I top off all my weapons. Cause yeah, it's only a hundred. God damn it. Careful. And now, just drop, jump, use, good. All right, this arc welder, or we're calling it, is great.
Ooh, okay. Makes sense now. I do want that crystal though, so sorry for the backtracking, but I'm gonna need it. I'm gonna need all the ammo I can get. Game decide to get a little harder. Entered new area. I love how it changed in my gun. No, no, that not going that way. That looks like superheated iron gas. It seared the flesh right off your bones. Great. That hasn't stopped me. I'm joking. I'm not gonna do that. Oh. All right, guys, I'll see you later. I'm by myself, meaning I can let loose a bit better. Um, there's something here. I'm not seeing it. figure you out. Okay, there's a weapon energy terminal right there. Do I have to blow up the pipe? No. Pipe is indestructible. So are those. Ah. 
I got a feeling I'm gonna be very, I'm, I'm stuck, and it's a very stupid reason to be stuck. Thing is the thing being powered. Weapon or energy terminal. Alright. Let me go back and see if they have any dialogue. Mitch. What? Hey. Hey, sorry. I'm kind of busy. Wait. Oh, I just found the side room. I didn't even find the main room. So I thought, yeah, you guys got me. Gun is very good. Plasma tubes. We must be getting close to the focusing chamber. Problem is, I can only see one way of getting to the other side. I don't know if touching that is a good idea.
I hear you. It's like a... Oh! This rifle is not as use useless as you think it would be. But now I'm alone again. Get up here, guys. Never mind. I guess I'm not alone. This level is very buggy. The sound keeps cutting. They're not moving where they should. The door is locked, sir. Tuvok said he disabled all the security locks. Too bad Chell isn't here. There's some micro fissures in the door structure. I think I can blow it. Up. Oh. Let's all move away. Take cover. This is as covery as I'm gonna get. Good work, Austin. I wouldn't be much of a demolitionist if I couldn't blow up a door. <laughs> I wouldn't be so much a yeah, I, I get it. Same thing as he said because Goodbye. I love the grenade launcher. It's shockingly a really good weapon. Alright, everyone on. You too, man. Thank you. No, 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 everyone on. Everyone on. Go, go, go. Thank you. Everyone's looking this way. Get the doors that way. Alright, I don't see anything yet. Yeah. Energy crystal, meaning go back to this for a kicking butt right now. I also got a feeling that... No, I think we're fine. Those days we want to self-sacrifice missions where your teammates stay behind, but I don't think it'll be that. I can see the harvester ship. It's almost a moment. You can't hit me. I accidentally switched my gun a few too many times, so I just start panicking. Oh, give me the crystals. I'm gonna need them. Yeah, this grenade launcher gets the job done. Alright, everyone, let's go. Oh, we're not bugging the elevator, though. Again, that's great.
long elevator. There we go. Oh, jeez. We're not getting through here with those rods down. Really? We can't crawl? Oh! like, oh great, now I'm stuck down here. No, I'm just being stupid. Alright, there's nothing here. I'm gonna top my health off because I'm an idiot. Alright, come on, man. I immediately hear one of them. No, oh, come on. Thank you. Keep giving me ammo to their weakness. My men. before they have a chance to ambush us. Come on. If you like the shots in. Alright, come on, men. I'm not waiting all day for your pad thing to fix. Alright, Mono and Mono, let's do this. And we got it. They want me to use the Arc Wielder, which I'll change to now since they're offering me plenty of ammo. Mr. Monroe, oh. you are in the storage chamber. The energy rounds for the weapon should be there. Here's one. But how do we get it to the firing chamber? Oh. We have to save Voyager.
is the delay? Why haven't you loaded the charge? Working on it, sir. Yeah, sir. Everything wants to kill us. What's the delay? Oh, you, I don't see you down here doing this. It's not going to affect it. Uh-oh. Oh! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. We're getting invaded right now, aren't we? Where's everyone else? We took some damage, had to beam you back separately. Tuvok needs you, come on. The Harvester ship was only disabled, but now they're trying to board us. That's one tough ship, but at least Voyager's still in one piece. Chang, Monroe, the Harvester's docking tendrils are attempting to breach the hull. Go to the equipment room and restock. Yes, sir. Watch it. I got all I need with this baby. Excuse me. Perhaps we can commiserate at a later time? I was hoping for a heal, but okay. As you can see, we took some casualties. Do you require medical attention? Actually, yes. I would like a little healing. Thank you. If you need medical attention, just come back here. All right, let's go. Harvesters are almost through. Come on. Damn it. Insects been seen the entire time. They're tearing the ship apart. Oh, they do a lot of damage. Like, a lot of damage. Actually, I'm gonna go back. They dealt me a lot of damage. Nope, wrong door. It's this door. Please. Indicate a possible neck injury. Oh, he's healing the guy I just saved. Nice. Sir, just a moment. Please. You'll be fine. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I need that. Okay, I'm going. Alright, make sure I got all the ammo I need. I'm going with my minigun, guys. I'll see you later. 
Wait, what? How oh, dare Come on. You're safe. Alright, I better double check and make sure everyone's fine on this end now because there are people hiding. Alright, you guys are fine. I don't. Yeah, I'm not going there. And now you can't go that way. Okay. I think I saved everyone in this area. I could. Let's go. I'm gonna get you. I really appreciate that. I appreciate it to the point where I'm gonna kill you. Oh. Everyone okay? We do not require medical attention. Your assistance is much appreciated, Ensign. I'll say. Any later and we might have been a harvester snack. When road a bridge, the harvesters have been eliminated. Good work, Ensign. We'll get cleanup crews down there on the double. Can't believe the aliens survived the hit from that dreadnought. It would have been much worse had we not disabled the harvester. Not that that's going to make anyone around here feel any better. What do you mean? Let's just say that, as ship's morale officer, I've noticed people are a little on edge from constantly being on the defensive for so long. I just hope we get out of here soon. Tuvok, Ensign Monroe, report to the conference room in half an hour. In other words, now. Oof, that one almost got me. Thank God he came around. ICDCM is working. Environmental controls and most critical systems will be online soon. But I don't know if we'll get full power back. How long before warp drive? I want to get Voyager as far from this death trap as possible. I might be able to get it up and running, but I can't guarantee its stability with that constant power drain from the forge's dampening field. Harry, what about sensors? Can we... Wait, aren't we... Go ahead, Ensign. What's on your mind? Well, aren't we going to counterattack? What? I mean, are we just going to sit here and wait for them to attack again, or are we going to strike back? I don't intend to leave Voyager a sitting duck, Ensign. Maybe you weren't paying attention just now, but we're doing our best to get out of here. Mr. Monroe, you were invited to this conference as a courtesy. The captain has rejected your proposal. Captain, I'm just saying what everyone is thinking. All right, Ensign. Just what is everyone thinking? Well, it's just that people are tired of being in the defensive. I have to agree. I've talked with some of the crew. Morale is low. They feel vulnerable. The best defense is often a strong offense. What are we supposed to do without engines and weapons? Drift over there and use harsh language? That thing's outer defenses could cut Voyager to ribbons. Not every problem can be solved by force, Ensign. I would have thought you would know that by now. While we're sitting here licking our wounds, the Forge could send another Harvester ship. All the more reason to get repairs done sooner. But what if the repairs can't be finished because of that dampening field? 
I understand. We're all feeling vulnerable. But I'm not just captain of this ship. I'm the captain of her crew as well. I can't ignore the morale of my people. If they don't get a chance to fight back, they might not have any fight left in them by the time the next harvester comes. And I can't ignore the fate of the other countless victims this forge has taken, and the ones it's yet to take. We've been fighting so hard for our own survival, we've almost forgotten our responsibility to the others trapped here. If we have a chance to stop this madness once and for all, we must take it. However, Voyager is in no shape to challenge the Forge. Mr. Monroe, I take it you have a plan in mind. Yes, I do. Trojan Horse. The Harvester ship? Of course! I can take a small team of my best people. We use the Harvester to enter the Forge and lower its defenses so you can send reinforcements and shuttles. If we can shut down the dampening field, Voyager and the other ships should be able to escape. We don't have any idea what kind of internal defenses that thing has. At the very least, we can buy Voyager some time. All right. Tuvok, Chakote, Monroe, let's put together a plan. It's time we brought the fight to our captors. Once the dampening field generator is down, we will evacuate the forge and return to Voyager via the shuttlecrafts. Crewman Jaworski, yes. Sir, how are we going to get the Harvester back to the Forge? We don't know how to operate it, do we? A science team has examined the Harvester ship and discovered an automatic recall system. The ship is programmed to return to the Forge on its own. Your team leader, Ensign Monroe, will now brief you on your specific mission objectives. Copy on this last mission. The first team is going to be a small group. Just myself, Telsia, Beesman, and Chell. We will board the Harvester and initiate the auto-return sequence. We believe the Harvester will return to this area of the Forge, a docking ring of some sort. Still under construction, apparently. Our scans indicate that the external defense's power grid is located somewhere in this area. Once we shut it down, we'll call for the reinforcements. That's where the rest of you come in. Once we rendezvous, we will spread out and proceed down this main shaft. We'll try to locate the generator for the dampening field and destroy it, allowing Voyager to escape. Any questions? Liz? What kind of resistance are we going to run into? Honestly, we don't know. We presume there'll be more harvesters over there and who knows what else. We don't know anything about this forge and who's operating it, but I expect pretty heavy resistance. Look, I know some of you must be scared. I know I am. But the Hazard team was created and trained for exactly this kind of dangerous assignment. We can beat this thing. This crew has repeatedly surprised and impressed me over these past several years. Starfleet, Maquis, and others. We've all come together and performed beyond the expectations of even the finest starship crew. I know you can do this. We will shut down this death trap. All right. Let's suit up and get going. My team, meet by the Harvester docking tendril in one half hour. Dismissed. Come to wish me luck, Tuvok? Vulcans do not believe in luck, Mr. Monroe. However, your success is crucial. And while I believe you will prevail, I hope that your mission does not encounter undue adversity. Thanks, Tuvok. We will join you as soon as your team deactivates the outer defenses. Oh, I'm not gonna walk around. I'm just going right in. Okay. Returning to base. Wait, does that mean we're gonna be in here for three and a half hours? Because that's how long it took technically to get to us. save I'm gonna call it we're in huh. the next one I think's the last one and before anyone talks I'm gonna cut it here what's this one gonna be called
people call Harvester Downfall. Why not? It's a nice name. But yeah, I'm going to leave it here. I think, judging by how this is going, the next one's going to be the last one. I'll finally beat this game after owning it for a few years. But until then, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Logging off L-Cars menu system.